Hey Cast and Chicks, Slipback Rocker here, and today we're taking a look at the fixed lid uh, hair pomade, medium hold, and high shine. Um, I used to use this stuff in middle school a lot, but I haven't used it in a long time. This is a newer pomade company on the market. You know, it's not like a traditional older pomade company. This is a newer product, obviously. Um, but I've been using it since middle school, and I figured. I do a little review on it on my channel here and take a look at it and see if it still holds up from my middle school era of uh, being a greaser. So let's go ahead and do a little review on it, shall we? So what I'm going to do first is wet the hair a little bit, kind of get it, you know, wet because it's dry in it. I was going to do this video yesterday, but I thought, I thought that I would just take a break from greasing my hair and give it my hair a break. So... Here we are today doing it. Um, this is what the can looks like, or tin, or jar looks like, in case you didn't know already. Medium hold, high shine pomade by Fix Your Lid. Um, yeah, this is the first one I was first, first greasing, and I didn't know about pomade as much as I do now. Um, the smell, it kind of smells like soap, honestly. Like, Kind of smells like um like a just type of hand soap you know that you uh, would use in a bathroom. That's what this kind of smells like. It smells like it'd be something like that. This is a brand new jar. Has not been used yet. Um, it's yeah, medium hold, high shine. Um, but with the hair wet, let's go ahead and apply some product and see how it turns out. So take that much. Um, before I start the ingredients in here. Um, this is an oil-based pomade, so it's going to take longer to get out if you use it. I'll go over the ingredients maybe after I use this, but let's go ahead and... This is a very thick for me, for a pomade. Usually I don't use pomades this thick, but I, I trust this product because I used to use it in the past, so. The one thing I don't like about this is it burns the hell out of your eyes. Like when you get in the shower or you're running and it's hot outside or doing whatever, it gets hot. It burns the fuck out of your eyes, but... I trust it because, like I said, I've been using this product for a long time. It's a good couple years I've used this. All right, with the evenly applied, let's go ahead and apply it in the hair. And that's how I like to do it. I like to rub it into the hands, get it evenly applied. And then when I'm ready, I will rub it in the hair. Sides, back, and front. Obviously, because if you want to slick back like I always do, and you're going to want to make sure you get all the sides, uh, down as much as you can, and the top as well, too, I guess. I'm just going to take some more here, about that much. So, and it does have a high shine, which is awesome. So, it does say what it means medium hold, high shine pomade, which, and it does have a high shine, too. So, for a newer pomade oil based product, I do like it. You know, it gives off that nice, greasy, oily looking shine, which I do like, and that's what I like in pomade. Um, when I use pomade, it's for it to have a high shine. So we use a little bit more just for the sake of it and just to keep my hair in place for the rest of the time when I have this product in. So just a little bit more, rub it in. I didn't really get the back, so I'm gonna get the back real quick. So I can kind of keep that where I want it. Maybe brush up the sides a little bit more. Mainly, maybe just a little bit on the top. And yeah, so I'm just wash my hands off real quick. And uh, we'll get using the product in here. Just brushing it down. Um, I feel like medium hole pomades, because if you can find them, and they say medium hole and soft, softer pomade products uh, work best for slick back looks. If you're going for a slick back look, grab a towel here, um, then obviously, I'd recommend using a medium hold or light hair product hold. So that is what that's what you're going for. So that should be enough pomade to hold me through for today at least. So let's go ahead and uh, put the lid back on. Roller brush, let's get it out. Let's get this going here. Oh yeah, this is a good product. It kind of stiff in the hairs a little bit, but and it's not that bad, you know? 
for a newer pomade company, man, this one definitely does what it's supposed to do. You know what I mean? Like, look at that shine, bro. Yeah, for a newer pomade company, I feel like this definitely does what it's supposed to do here, and that is keep your hair in place as being a medium hold product. Brush up the sides a bit. I hate those fucking little hairs that always poke out. It's annoying as hell. I don't like it. It's like, just stay where the hell I put you, but you won't. So then you're gonna piss me off even more. Yeah, I feel like for a medium hold, this is definitely worth it. You know, if, if you're, that's what you're looking for, at least as a medium hold, this is what you're gonna wanna get. At least for a newer pomade product company, um, this is what you're gonna wanna get, is something like Fix Your Lid. It does its job. It does it well. All right, so I'm gonna add just a little bit more on the sides because this side is not staying down like it needs to. I'm just gonna add a little tiny bit more, not even much. Perfect. Just what I needed. Wash it off again. And that's kind of pretty much it, guys. I mean, I feel like this pomade's definitely a good pomade company if you haven't checked it out. Um, most newer pomade companies are expensive and they're not really worth it, but this actually, this one actually is, I will admit. Um, it's $9, which is a little expensive, but not too expensive for a, uh, uh, how many ounces does this say? Yeah, 3.75 ounces of hair product in here. I feel like that's definitely worth it. I'm just gonna touch it up a little bit more and we'll be done. I mean, this hair's already looking good from the product. But yeah, I feel like for a newer product, it's definitely worth it, man. You know what I mean? It definitely does its job. But yeah, so that's kind of my review on uh, Facial Lid. Go ahead and take a look at the shine real quick. It definitely gives the high shine, which I like, so. I recommend this product if you haven't tried it out already, if you're a pomade enthusiast or you use pomade products and you're looking for something new, check this company out. I recommend it. Um, it does burn the hell out of your eyes though, which sucks, but that's not really, you know, it's really meant to just keep your hair in place, but yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and share. See y'all next time when I do a review on Royal Crown and the Vaseline Hair Tonic. See you later.